Sean? <laughs> What's going on? Chilling, chilling. We have a beer courtesy mm-hmm. of Mr. Keith at 93 Lumber. 93 Lumber. This is Skaboom. Four City Brewing Company. Uh, 4.7% ABV. I'm really interested to try this. Uh, it oh, is New Year's Eve. What's the ABV of Guinness? Pacing ourselves. Uh, four, eight. Yeah, you're right. Um, I forget if he gave me this at Beer to a Palooza or if he sent it in a beer mail. I don't remember. But either way, I do know it's from Keith. The man, the myth, the legend. It sure looks like a stout to me. Really nice head, too. It's nice. Um, yeah, it, it, it's... Um Almost pitch black, very very dark. The head is just like a almost khaki. Yeah, this looks sort of awesome, honestly. That looks really like just one finger. I got one finger ahead. It's just yeah, it's like big big bubbles too. Yeah, nice lace. You see that? Yeah, it looks fantastic. Let's see what it knows. That's what I want in a fucking stout. I don't need to smell strawberries. I don't need to smell candy canes. I don't need to smell. Chocolate. Sometimes I do, but yeah, I mean, this you're, you're just basically getting like vintage, old school stuff. Roasty, toasty. Just a little bit of. I mean, these almost smell slightly chalky to me. I was gonna say malt balls, but but yeah, yeah. I can see the chalkiness too. Yeah, I, mean, I don't mean that in a bad way. Yeah, yeah, yeah no, I know. Bad. Um, but yeah, I mean, it's, it smells like an old school stout. It's it's a little bit of chocolate, just yeah. a lot of roast. Yeah. Just, I, I almost a, just a hint of vanilla. Yep. <sighs> Man, <laughs> I want to try it. Let's do it. Cheers. Cheers. Thanks, Keith. Thanks. Tastes like a stout. Yeah, it's a little bit lighter than I was expecting given the nose. There's something a little bit weird on the aftertaste, but in the front, I, it's I think it's because it's so cold. Yeah, yeah. I didn't put it in my stout fridge. Um, How yeah. fucking bougie does that sound? Didn't put it in my stout fridge. Pretty bougie. <laughs> AK, when I say stout fridge, I mean my like probably like a million year old mini fridge, courtesy of my buddy Larry. Thank you, dude. Uh, my stout fridge is like a a wine mm. fridge. Which is a little douchier, I think. <laughs> a little bit. <laughs> Temperature control. But anyways, yeah. No, other than that little aftertaste, you're right. It's probably from the cold. It has the roasty toastiness. Um, and 4.7%. 4, 4. Like, if you want, like, just, like, a stout and you don't want to fuck around, like, with something big and bold, this is perfect. Yeah, in, in its own way, it is kind of bold, though. But it's it, it's not going to kick your ass. When I say big and bold, sorry, I, I meant, like, high ABV. But, yeah, yeah, no, you're right. No, it has... It, it, it's nice. It, it, it's It's... it's Pretty easy to drink as far as stouts goes, but like if, if your stout game is basically like that you've had Guinness a few times, then this is way up your alley. Then yeah, hundred percent. You know this isn't this isn't your your Russian Imperial. This is just a dark malt. Yeah, a little bit of hops, a little bit of yeast, a little bit of water. It's I mean, delicious. Yeah it's, it's, yeah, it's well made. Nice. Um, down in the comments, have you had Four City Brewing's Skaboom? 4.7% stout. They're out of, if I was going to guess, New Jersey. That's what I was going to guess. Um, but yeah, and also, if you haven't subscribed or checked out 93 Lumber, head on over his channel. We'll link to it right here. And uh, check out Key's videos. They are awesome. He actually knows what he's talking about. Unlike us. Yeah. Uh, Nerdsense.net, Instagram, Facebook, Twitter, those are your things. Like, comment, subscribe, hit those notification bells so you're notified when we post new videos. And I'm Sean. I'm Mike. And, and this, this is Nerdsense. Nerd